Hey everybody, I'm here with Mira Mishra from Mumbai, who is working on putting together the Carbon Reset Summit, which is a global summit focused on carbon removal in India. Hey Mira, tell us a bit about uh, what you're working on. Hey, hi Tito. So um, yeah, the Carbon Reset Summit, it's a durable carbon removal summit. There are two big agendas for the summit. Like first to give a little bit of context, um, India is the second largest producer of agricultural biomass in the world. Um, that's only after China. And um, we're talking about like almost 990 million metric tons of agricultural biomass each year. Um, so that's a big opportunity when we look at unlocking supply uh, for from a biochar uh, as a technology perspective for carbon removal. And for the summit itself, like the two main agendas is to um unlock capital flow in this direction so getting newer investors philanthropic uh, patient capital to sort of flow uh, in this direction for us to be uh it's for, for us to be able to activate this entire uh supply of carbon removal credits uh second india is also the hub of um uh, all of the scientists and researchers who are working uh in academia and can be uh, potential um, carbon removal entrepreneurs. We already have some successful ones out there who have won X Prize and they come from prestigious institutes like IIT Bombay who are partnering with us on the summit. And uh, to get the demographic dividend of India to work in its favor while we are reversing climate change, I think that's going to be big for us as a country, but also for the world for where we are right now. And um, how we want carbon removal to grow like 40% year on year. This is our opportunity to make that happen. Awesome. I love that. I love the, 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 the vision for how we can remove billions of tons of carbon. India is positioned to, to uh, make it happen. And that's what this, that's what this summit is about is actually not just positioned to make it happen, but actually that's happening. Um, so how did you, how did you get started on this? What, um, yeah. Uh, tell us, tell us about that. Yeah, so I'd basically taken a break from all of the amazing climate software work that I was doing. My last startup was backed by Y Combinator. And uh, after working with um, like 14 hour days, working with international customers and all of that, I was on a little bit of a break when my friend Hanvi Oja introduced me to the world of carbon removal. I got really um, deep into the world of carbon removal, also thanks to the amazing community that we have on LinkedIn. Um, and, uh, yeah, then we saw a video of you, which then we just like, you know, um, uh, at the perfect time, just sent it my way. And it was all about organizing this investor summit in San Francisco. Uh, we had that 15 minutes introduction call and you were like, do one in Mumbai instead. And I'm like, uh, but I wanted to help you on the one that you're doing in San Francisco. And then you're like, no, but do one in Mumbai instead. And I'm like okay, do we have a budget for this? And then you're like, you'll find the budget. And then you just like gave me uh, Aaron from Kimka's number. I spoke to Aaron. He's like, yeah, we'll, we'll back this. And then I'm like, okay, this is just, I mean, it 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 sounds amazingly simple when we're, when we're just talking about this, but honestly, it, it has been um, a great uh, test of patience, perseverance, and uh, tested my commitment towards carbon removal and almost... Um, made me sort of double down on my commitment by virtue of testing me on multiple occasions. So, yeah. Wow. Do you have any recommendations for people that are, that are watching this that really want to, uh, yeah, go all out, go all out on carbon removal? Yeah. I mean, I have only one thing to say that if you really want uh, carbon removal to be the next best thing that happens to humankind and the next best thing that happens to the uh, world in terms of being able to reverse climate change in time before we are wiped off the planet, then um, India is well positioned to be um, that 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 enabler, that actor, and you just have to sort of like be here, be part of the summit, be part of the conversations, uh, be part of like the action that that is needed to unlock this. So if Folks like Julio Friedman from Carbon Direct, Ryan Auberg from Low Carbon Capital, Daniel Pike from RMI, uh, Jan Mazurek from Climate Works Foundation, Kelly and Noen from Bezos Earth, Fund, uh, Bezos Earth Fund, and of course, like you know, folks like Kevin Tidwell from Grantham. If all of such people, um, 
if 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 you know we, we can have them in the room and uh, help us unlock this and of course Tito you like if you're in the room and if you can sort of like um, get get all of the blockers out of the way I think we have amazing potential to make this really be the turning point for uh, carbon removal action that's uh, like you know how how we position globally and how we really want we want the tides to turn. Awesome. Thank you for your leadership, Mira. It sounds like Mumbai is the place to be to reverse climate change. And when is the conference? It's on October 8th. And uh, if if you want to help spread the word, uh, it's carbonreset.co. And all the details are on there, uh, how we're sort of envisioning the entire day to flow. It's all on there. Um, yeah, just like spread the word, be a part of it. That's how you could um, enable this. Um, also, if you're an expert in this area, can help uh, in any way for the biochar ecosystems to sort of like take off in India, then uh, reach out to me and I would put, sort of put you in on this great database that I'm creating for all biochar project developers and startups to sort of have access to. So yeah, that's another thing that um, I would really sort of love for it to happen as an outcome of this. Awesome. Thank you for your leadership, Mira. Thanks, Tito, for making this happen.